Hi everyone, welcome back to Prakasham Tutorials. In this video, I am going to discuss about baseband MRA PAM transmission. In the baseband binary PAM transmission, the pulse amplitude modulator produces binary pulses with one of two possible amplitude levels. So that one of two amplitude possible levels are a suffix k is equal to plus 1 if binary symbol bk is 1 and a suffix k is equal to minus 1 if symbol bk is 0. That are the two amplitude levels in case of baseband binary PAM transmission. But in case of baseband MRA PAM transmission, the pulse amplitude modulator produces one of m possible amplitude levels with m greater than 2. This can be explained with the help of following example that is inner ternary system inner ternary system with binary data sequence 0 0 1 0 1 1 0 1 1 1 so now here in this diagram and this is the output of a quaternary system and this is the waveform of the quaternary system and this table represents the representation of four possible diabetes based on gray encoding. So now here in this figure we can observe that the figure here shows the different amplitude levels of the gray code different amplitude levels of the gray code sequence and figure B shows the electrical representation of the given binary data using inortinary system. So pulse duration of binary PAM system is denoted by T suffix B. So in case of binary PAM system, the pulse duration is represented by T suffix B. But in case of MRA PAM transmission system, the pulse duration is denoted as capital T is equal to 2 into TB. Here, the symbol duration capital T is called as the signaling rate of the system, which is represented as symbols per seconds. The symbols per second is nothing but a watts. In case of MRA PAM system, one baud is equal log m base 2 bits per second. The symbol rate is 1 by 2 TB since each symbol consists of 2 bits. Each symbol. Now here the, there are 2 symbols. The 2 bits will consist of a symbol rate. So that is now here uh, m or a PAM system 2 TB is the symbol rate. The symbol rate of MRAP PAM system is related to the symbol duration of the binary PAM system and it is given by mathematically that relation symbol duration of MRAP PAM system and symbol duration of binary PAM system mathematical expression capital T is equal T suffix B into log M base 2. Therefore, in case of MRA PAM transmission in a given channel bandwidth, it is possible to transmit log M base 2 times faster than binary PAM system. The transmitter power must be increased by the factor M square by log M base 2 compared to a binary PAM system. In a baseband MRA PAM transmission system, the input binary sequence converted into an M level PAM pulse train. The detection process is same as the binary PAM at the receiver section. That is, first the, first the M level PAM pulses are transmitted over the channel which is affected by the noise and distortion. The received signal is passed through the receiver filter, receive filter, and then sampled at appropriate time intervals. Each sample is compared with the predefined threshold value, and the decision is made to which the symbol was transmitted. In order to reduce the bit errors, which are introduced due to 
inter symbol interference and noise we have to design the transmit and receive filter and pulse shape as same as the baseband binary pam system obviously in an m array pam system there are m minus 1 threshold levels which makes the system complicated this is the concept of baseband m array pam transmission